advertisement male hero just took on a whole new meaning. On Thursday, the Ad Council released a PSA featuring some of Warner Brothers' most recognizable blockbuster stars, all wearing masks in support of COVID-19 get push notifications with news, features and more. Follow follow and yell get the latest updates on this topic in your browser notification. The 32nd PSA packs quite a few film franchises into its short runtime, including Harry Potter, Wonder Woman, The Matrix, Austin Powers, The Lord of the Rings and Creed. Even its Pennywise makes a creepy, albeit safe, in a virus protection sense. Appearance Iconic standalone flicks like Casablanca and Joker are also featured in the action-packed clip titled Mask Up America. In the final sequence, Jason Momoa's Aquaman is shown telling Batman, from behind his own mask, I Paul Rudd plays certified young person in new PSA, tells millennials to wear masks amid the fun clips, the ad council tells viewers, let's get back. to doing our favorite things, whatever it's slow the spread. The group continues in the PSA. Mask Up America. Lisa Sherman, Ad Council President and CEO, said in a statement obtained by Weekly that they were inspired to create the PSA, in conjunction with the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention and Warner Media, because we know that face masks continue to be one of the most effective ways we can protect ourselves and we're truly grateful to Warner for lending their talent in iconic films to support to this critical message, Sherman. Dr. Anthony Fauci, President Joe Biden's chief medical advisor and the country's leading physician on infectious diseases, said Thursday on the Today Show that not only is wearing a mask to help curb further spread of the virus something the CDC recommends for everyone who is able but doubling up on masks can ensure it. The recommendation is not that you have to wear two masks. What the CDC is saying is, at minimum, wear a mask, added Fauci. The Institute for Health Metrics and Evaluation reported late last month that close to 22,000 lives could be saved by May if 95% of Americans wore masks.